super in English, but not Japanese. I'm waiting till English is fully finished, then it's I'm gonna, gonna be a binge while. it all. It's yeah. gonna be a while. First oh. people to bring, first five people to bring a setup to the even further beyond event will get their venue waived. Yep. And what a setup is is it's a PS4, the game, got the DLC. Content, Make sure you have all the DLC. Uh, and we need all the DLC. And a controller. Okay, starting off now, Sonic Cyclone versus Critter. Uh, Critter, a an Ike main that we haven't seen in quite a while, yeah, like we've said, but he has been a traditionally strong player in the DFW region. Uh, in the very early days of this game when he was around. For sure. Uh, Sonic Cyclone, a uh, character that I haven't seen around very much. Is Sonic Cyclone the brother of uh, Gibson Rules? Kind of looks similar, don't they? I think so. Um, I've seen Gibson around uh, quite a bit. I haven't seen Sonic Cyclone around that much. And before, it is Gibson Rules and he just changed his name. Yeah, that'd be... Uh, <laughs> but it doesn't look That'd like be it cheating. Is. Yeah. Pulling a Static Manny there. But, but uh, he's doing really well. Yeah, I Fitter feel like, has not touched him. Yeah, I feel like this is definitely one of the oh. harder matches for Ike as a as a slower character. But if he utilizes, you know, those those uh, that dish run, like when homing attacks happening and when spin dash is approaching, he can really. And I think his not his jab, but his down tilt clanks, so he can actually stop the momentum from the spin dash and actually get a lot more damage. Here. He seems to be really patient. This is a rough matchup for a slower character for sure. Yeah, he does have that big old hitbox to try to challenge. I like the attempt there with the dash attack. It's a little bit off with the spacing. Yep, and then we have Sonic Cyclone just looking for the spring to up air, but whoa, a little catch Critter, there. Not gonna kill them. Critter's empty hops are doing him no favors. For like, sure. against some other characters, maybe you're like baiting the pressure of that, but at the distance that you're at against Sonic, he can mm -hmm. wait for you to get a little bit too low to throw anything out and just commit to hurting you. Yeah, I feel like Critter will get a lot more mileage on staying this. grounded and then waiting for Slycone to come to him and then punish him accordingly. Approaching and jumping is not working out at all. But yeah. we'll <laughs> it looks like uh, Sonic Cyclone's just been waiting for Critter to commit to something, be it an empty hop, which is very non-committal, but still enough for a character like Ike um, for Sonic to take advantage of. Yeah. Especially when he's made a habit of it. He knows that the hitbox is not coming yep. flying. Look at that right so there. he can just spin right through. Yeah, and, he's, and it's and it's even more disparaging when you're halfway across the stage and he still catches and punishes your jump. Uh, okay. Wow, yeah. A little bit of overextending there. And he's, yeah, I love the patience there from, from Critter, but he just didn't have the opportunity to react there and get a punish. I do like that Critter is not committing too hard, because um, committing to a, a very lagging move could be worse uh, than just these empty hops that he's getting punished for. But he needs to realize that sometimes he just needs to commit to something and take care of things. Great. There we go. That's exactly what I wanted him to do. I wanted that patience. I wanted him to stay grounded. And that's exactly what he did. Sonic, Cy Sonic Cyclone dug his own grave there. Accidentally narrowed off stage. That spring was the weirdest spot that I've ever yeah, seen. Yeah, it was definitely an accident for sure. Yeah, I no, he like meant he... to put it off stage, but it kind of bounced on. That was interesting. For sure. Oh my gosh. First time we threw out the counter in the air. Great patience from Cyclone to punish that. I mean, the whole time I feel like Cyclone's just been reacting at a at a safe distance for Sonic to set that up. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's it. And yeah. maybe the counter's not the best idea. Yeah, so what I, what I noticed a lot, um, and what I think Critter should really start to do in this next game, is that um, stay grounded for one, yeah. and then really let Cyclone dig his own grave. That's how we got that first stock. Cyclone put himself in a bad position, set himself up perfectly to get that uh, up tilt, the mm -hmm. Critter, so I really want to see more patience, less short hops, less jumping right. on the stage. What I would rather see is him just walking slowly towards Sonic Cyclone. If you see that he's going to spin dash, you can react with a shield. You're not blocked out of it like you would be in an initial exactly. dash. Yeah. And you definitely always have it available to you, unlike when you're in the air. Mm -hmm. um, so you could just walk slowly, uh, shield if you need to, or try to maybe challenge with jab. I know that Falcon's jab is really good for challenging Sonic spin dash. Maybe Ike's Yeah, I'm not sure I if Ike's dash, the, the, at least the first hit, um, mm -hmm. Clanks or not, so yeah. I, don't, I know for sure down tilt does. Okay, so, so he should just be walking around a little bit more and shielding. Yeah, less dashing. And then once Cyclone uh, commits and maybe like pushes himself off stage because he has to go through you and wants to try to keep it safe, oh. he then has to get back on stage. I'm like this, he's got a lead. And I really want him, when he gets that lead, to really start trying to make Cyclone play his game. That's really one of the more difficult things when playing against Sonic. But if you can achieve it, you get so much mileage out of it. Like here, I really feel like he shouldn't be approaching as much. He's on the winning end of the percent, but then right there, the Cyclone can just come in and change that in an instant. 
Every Cyclone gets another grab, doesn't quite find a confirm oh that! Oh my god, he made him play his game, almost took the stock. That was a super scary spot for Critter. That was a sick bait. <laughs> right? It's like, hey man, I'm just jumping on this ring, wanna jump too? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So he's, and he's still doing these short hops. I, I, he's been punished so many times for them. They're Cyclone being super patient, but like, I really think that Critter needs to start trying to make Cyclone approach him, because he's gonna eventually snap and come towards him. I feel like most of the time Cyclone's like waiting for him to go for one of these short hops. It does clink. There cool. we go. Jab. Real good. So yeah, walking around. Stop yeah. dashing so much. Exactly. Walking around, jabbing. Really good, really good Nair. It worked out. It, it, he's tried that multiple times and it didn't work, but it worked this time. Oh, and he got his face enough so he could actually do that. That was such a hard for me. Okay, got back on. <laughs> he tried to do it again. I yeah. liked that, yeah. It's really weird that Critter will like commit to absolutely nothing. That was so good. Yeah. That up air had no lag. That was a really smart bait. I definitely didn't expect that. Smart uh, Sonic Cyclone. Intimate knowledge of the auto cancel number of that up air. Yep. Yeah, Critter again. absolutely kind of didn't have that, so that was a free free punish. Yep, finally Great. got the dash attack. He's been looking for that this entire set, and he's finally got the first stock here. Let's see what he can do with it. Let's see how long he can milk this lead. Because now Cyclone has to approach, and now we can play this patient game. He, just, he doesn't have to move around. He can just sit there and be very patient. Oh, just getting the clip of that last up here. Not getting much damage. Neutral B gets a punish. Very good patience. They didn't expect the homing attack there. Yeah, still looking for a way to punish these, and uh, yeah, he's, he's been playing it good. And the Cyclone, you can see him already breaking under the pressure of being under a stock. Right, Sonic, I feel like, is one of the few characters that just shifts tiers, depending on whether he has the lead or not. The yeah. stock lead is especially important. Yep, and man, it just keeps building. He can't find the stock off. Wow, what spacing there from, uh, from Critter with that dash attack? All right, another back throw attempt, and it is not as strong as it was at the beginning of this game. He tries to go for a spring, but Ike just fights through it, no worries. We're gonna go, go for down again. throw? Okay, okay up throw. Yeah, probably getting close to those up throw points. I'm expecting like 180. I didn't think it would kill, so I was expecting a down throw to just force Ike off stage and maybe grab position. Or even forward throw to mix up DI there would be fine. But there we go, eventually Gret gets that back throw at the edge of the stage, and 180 is gonna do it. Yeah, but we still have Critter in the lead. This can be built up really quickly by a Sonic. And get that percent, can get that stock yeah, off fast. Critter can't let us get away from it. Look at that! Oh my god. He keeps getting like oh my god. <laughs> just the edges of his multi hits, not oh getting everything he wants. Oh my gosh, what a catch there on the ledge. Still, just racks it up. He's almost already brought all the percent back. I like that he waited that out, didn't go for the downer, didn't get countered. Okay, back throw. Yep. unsafe oh. neutral air getting punished, sent into the blast zone almost. Just goes for up throw for damage. Now, Cyclone has the lead back. All it took was one stock, and then the extra damage is easy peasy. Yeah, super important. And then it's, it's that quick that he can get away from you. I really wanted to see a more patient playstyle from Crater where he just lets Cyclone come and try to approach him, and he punishes accordingly. Great Nair. Great Nair. But he doesn't get the punish that he wants. Sonic okay. has some trouble some landing. Yeah, Bear Dodge doesn't have a jump. Great does spring. have a spring, though. Okay. So now. Okay, didn't actually go to try to catch some with the... Oh my gosh, I thought he was going to go for it there. Yeah, I thought he was going to, but he didn't react in time. Or maybe his, uh... We oh. finally, he'd been looking for that the entire set and finally landed it. That's, that was really nice. Yeah, he got it. Finally got it. Sonic Played Cyclone. Really solid from, from behind. Never gave up on his strat of uh, being patient and waiting for his opportunities, which I really like. Yeah. Um, because a lot of the time... When you're down like that and you're Sonic, you're like, I got to close this out. Exactly. That way I can start, you know, building stuff up again. Maybe